Good afternoon and welcome on in for another edition of From Day One. As we turn the big nine. Well, that's actually while we're grabbing the gifts here, take a situation what's over there on the right hand bar. You can see that the quote unquote boxy target. Oh, hold on, we actually lost? I'm going to have to take a look at that. Of course, we have our chest. It says that the goal is at 10.022%. You might be going, what? <laughs> um, that's because that is going to be the new boxy goal. Extras actually has three tiers of goals for the creators program. Goal one was 5,000 views. That, I can say, as of today, you have helped us achieve. We are greatly appreciative for such. Thank you. The second goal is 50,000 views. And our number of views based on that goal is what creates that 10.022%. Additional items that will occur there is that actually Boxy will start sending these little red boxes. These boxes will have a bunch of abilities and items that you need in game but will also give me the extra added ability where I can actually just punch in one of your guys' ID numbers. The ID numbers that you get once you click on your name over in the right hand side. Once we finish this section I'll show you exactly what I'm referring to. And it'll automatically send that box to be in your mailbox. From here to there. And there's one that's for skin stones. There's one that's for... Uh, oh, there's three different types. They give you one of each every month at that 50,000 threshold. The final threshold, and we're definitely going to be a long ways off from that, but it is something down the road to think of, is the 500,000 views, and then they triple those boxes, so they send you three of each box a month to be able to send out to folks. So we start our Sounds of Dominion night. In the cross server tournament of the elements, trying to finish stage five. Better than last time, but yeah, it is. But my team just, our team doesn't match up quite well with that particular set. Now you might be asking, well, didn't you say once you reach that first goal of 5,000 views, you'd be able to start sending some gifts out to all of us who watch? And yes, we did. And yes, we will. Unfortunately... 
this is where real life mm, pops its ugly little head into everyone's enjoyable world. As we all at the moment currently know, that part of the world, Eastern Europe, that is not the best stable location at the moment. As such, communications with Nexter's staff is also not the absolute best at the moment as a result. And they have to manually review all of us here at from day one to verify that we have indeed crossed that threshold for the first level of their uh, partner creative program to go ahead and get credit, have Boxy actually pay attention instead of trying to dodge anything that might be going on in real life over there at the moment. To us. And we worked hard over the last three to four months to get to where we are today. But we all also hear from the From Day One crew as laughable as that term may be, can most definitely understand real life situations. One thing you'll know if you come in you see one of our videos, this thing has like say 32 days listed instead of two days. Then you'll know and then I'll also know that boxy was able to review. That's one of the changes that will occur for that first level situation. And the moment that happens, so I don't have to keep ponying in the dollar and eighty nine cents US each week for Valkyrie Favor. Then I can turn that dollar eighty nine into items that we send off to you. That was always our original plan here on the from day one program. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry again about the yawning. Oh, 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 get back in there. At the moment that we no longer had to pay, we weren't going to just pocket. The dollar eighty nine. We were then going to be able to use that to send out prizes and gifts to watchers until we made level two, which would then stamp the packages that would come from Boxy next year. So stay tuned to see when we do get approved by Boxy, so that we could all move along together. That is where we are in regards to all of that. Let's collect a little bit of prizes that we've currently triggered. Right now it's inside. Uh, let me grab the clock real quick. It is 40 minutes before Guild Reset. In other words, before 2 a.m. UTC. Where normally everything would reset. Right now, I'm trying to do mission critical. Oh, sorry. Again, I don't know why. I don't know this time. Mission critical tasks that we need to have done for that. Like that crosshair return them into the elements that we just did. Uh, 
All right, so the energy is picking up what we wanted to do there. All right, special event. Looking forward to get our box of soul stones. You get those anytime you do 28 days or more in a calendar month. Logging in, that is. And I let you have 50 soul stones of almost every hero. Of, oh, ah, almost of any hero that you'd want. There are a few restrictions as to which hero you can specifically do. And there again, the Nick test doesn't come in until 2 a.m. UTC. So today's items in our Ascension Season include win in arena using a healer, heal the healer, uh, sorry, heal the heroes for 200 thou in the tower, level up a support hero skin, two day tasks 25 times, so two more trips, and the weeklies are going to be done because once that four days does, it'll disappear. As there's only six uh, uh, six days and change left. So support skin. Yes, they're, call, they're calling. Uh, yeah, the Astaroth, I guess, has a second level bill of Alright, let's give him two levels. There's that task. Okay, so those are both going to be arena tasks. Alright, so let's just start ticking down the list, shall we? Gift of the Elements. Let's see. So last year, the lowest individual on that list. So there you go. Tower and Titanite will save for a moment. XP Potion. Um, Dante, you can go up to 75 today. Dante is a decent, very strength attack based hero. The non quite heroic, but definitely wishes they were heroic chest of the night. <laughs> And upgrade our hero skills. Okay. Okay, start leveling Dante up a little bit. Let's bring his stats up tonight. There we go. Okay. We'll come back because we definitely will still need to hit this sword before the old reset. Last all our for all coins would just go into dolls instead. Uh, Asgard. Oh, so this I actually did do yesterday. Okay. 
I thought I had it, and then I was having like a full seven stockpiled. My bad. Still seven minutes, so okay, we'll definitely leave that for the moment. Alright, let's take a look at the sword. So we got 48,900. If we did nothing, it would turn into 65 Judge Dolls. But that's going to be arguably the worst play to make because, let's take a look, if you did them all, it's 48. Well, actually, in our case, it would actually come out quite different because it would only be 150 coins. That's the situation. You want to leave as few brawl coins on the table, so to speak. Alright, so we always go with the highest items first to figure what you're going to want to do. None of these reds should even have a case because they're 120 plus. Don't need any Book of Fate? Yeah. Well, it says I can use Staff and the Prophetic Orbs. Hmm. Interesting. Well, in that case, Do two of those, do one of those, 3,900, and get us into this category. Those and you might say, Hey, nine hundred, that'll get you two dolls. And yes, that is the case, it could do so, but question is, is there something? More needed. Hmm. If I buy one pack of coins, that'll get you nineteen. That'll get me a hand of glory. Um, hold on a second. I want to see something. Do I have extra hint of glory sitting or not? Okay, I do have extras. Let me line up everything that I can. Okay, there is no more of those. Or those. Okay, there is candles. Because if, if I need like six and I only had one, that might be something to do. If I've got enough backgrounds that I can do like six. Okay, so I got four. It says I would need six. If I did it, that would give me 19 minus 1250 would be 650. But you normally then only be good enough for one. That's all that is. But I then could get a 500 item or two of the rosaries and still have something. 
and Bronkhorn left. That something would then still give me a doll. I'm looking to see if there is specifically anything of any significance. Well, if we do 2 to 29, 25, and 450, let's do that. Two sets to me. Two of these. Four hundred, give me one rosary. And then one fifty will trade into one doll. Done. Done, done, done. Okay. Yeah, so we're gonna need four hundred K. Let's see if we can get that in the tower. We start to climb up Sunshine Tower for today. As always, since we did complete every tower level in the previous day, we do get to skip the first 26 levels. Onward and upward we move. Alrighty, number four we get. Tower coin. Four three we skip. Onward to six. Take the blade of blades. The only thing we don't have yet is a magic shield of some sort. Treasure chest on eight. Gets us some gold. Skip on nine to a chest on ten. More gold. 11 to a buff on 12. Onward to 13. To a chest on 14. Tower coin. 15 to another tower chest on 16. To the green, uh, sorry, orange item that we don't need, the helm. 17. To a buff on 18. I believe now we're actually 50% armored. Yeah. 19 to 20 on the chest. Of course, the one we could actually use we don't get. 21 will give us another chest on 22. Use the blades, but we get gold. 23 gives us a buff on 24. And we're going to we're going to go the rest of the way here. 25 to 26. Double crits with 300 tar coins there. First attack of the afternoon is going to be a 102 K team. Both 
Well, sounds good. Maybe bring us some power. Right here. Got your chest on 28. Gets us more gold. 104,000. With nobody really of any strong significance. A lot more control and healing base. That's it. <laughs> That's it. All right, Skippy the Sword Cavalcade, level thirty-one, gets us a hundred and six thousand combination of the dead style team this time around. And winner. So we move on now. Treasure chest gets up. Terror coins. First of the doubles. At a hundred and eight. Or is it not? Yeah, it's 108. Okay. The second half gets the hundred and ten thousand seven hundred. Thirty-five with a treasure chest. Onward to thirty-six. Falling at just about the same exact second. Get the buff on 37, give us an attack on 38, just coming on 39 for 116.6k. The chest provides some Le Mort cards. Second to last double, starting at one at level forty. Hundred seventeen K.
tell you guys what we can do. Start thinking of what you would like as a prize from Dominion. Start posting it down either in the live chat during premieres or down in the comments. Or, of course, you can also do it over in our email, gcarrowwars at gmail.com. Once Foxy does get around to approving us so those items do become available, we can go with whatever you guys is best and most popular suggestion as to what kind of prize you would like to be able to win for watching. So we move on to 122k. We do air daily at 7 p.m., 2 a.m., and 7 a.m. UTC, which of course is 2 p.m. Eastern, 9 p.m. Eastern, and 2 a.m. Eastern. With the only exception, of course, being Thursday. In deference. Indifference to Hero Wars Charlie, as he's been doing this longer than we have, we delay the second episode of the day for half hour, so it starts at 9.30 p.m. Eastern or 2.30 a.m. UTC, instead of on the hour, because he starts his shows an hour before that and goes for an hour. will among fellow creators and we do not wish to step on anyone else's programming slots so they were here first they had the 2 a.m. UTC on Thursdays they like to premiere any new tasks that would come out on Friday morning for the weekend tasks so we graciously they are there first we move our Schedule accordingly on that day. But it just starts a half hour later, so instead of 2, we start at 2.30 UTC. Okay. So, let's see if we have any spheres that we can redeem for Titans. A 
as you can see by that sword, we're inside of 10 minutes before the 2 a.m. UTC reset would occur. The four task doll event will begin then. So we have 30 for Nova today. And that's it. That sucked. <laughs> if you don't catch me kindly there, that sucked for choices. Alrighty, so we started, of course, Moloch on down. Eating 770 to absolute. Angus needing 956. Mari needing 873. We skip over the next guy, of course, because he's already absoluted. Avalon needs 1230. Sylvia needs 872. And finally, Ignis needs 1009. Unfortunately, none of them are in the ballpark that we can use the Defender Titans quite just on. Well, let's see, we have three days worth of Platinum Boxes. Let's see if we get any luck out of these. Well, I get 250 energy. Got an orange item. Got a purple item. Got two orange items. Two purple items. Not, not too terrible of a pull. As you see here, we got two 100 and a 50. Pull stone. As you see, the 50 doesn't allow you to do Cleaver, Jet, Elvenor, Tristan, or Iris. The 100 ones only block out Cleaver, Jet, Tristan, and Iris. So Alvinor is allowed in the hundreds while not in the fifty. Alright, next expedition task. Let's get you going. Well, looks like we're gonna pick up a few Flawless ones on this one, right there. One it just completed. We get second to the top level, not bad. Purple item. Now the higher level items are of course what you really want to get, because if you do ever need the lower items, you can always trade down. The others you can sell the top ones for second, third, or fourth tier. You can sell the second tier for third or fourth. The third can only sell for the fourth. Actually, let's go up there and I'll show you what I mean real quick. Easiest way, let's grab somebody who's got some Unimproved black level. Or actually, that work quite kindly. Uh, actually, not quite as kindly as I thought. Because you have to actually be out of an item before you get the offer. Um, maybe Dante is closer. All right, let's do it down here, because it looks like it's only about three. Okay, there we go. That's what I want, resource exchange. So as you can see, the base metal is the black one. That's the lowest level you can get. Then it goes green, blue, violet, and orange, just like you're heroing up levels in Hero Wars. You can take the green level items and sell down to get two black per green. 
four for each blue, eight for each violet, or sixteen if you sell off a flawless to get to this point. Likewise, if you're trying to get greens, these would only be two, four, and eight respectively. If you're getting blue, these would be two and four. And if you're getting violet, these would only be two. Remember, you can never go back up the chain, so I can't sell two of the violet to get one flawless. This is how those work. Alrighty, let's take a look at the arena. Don't remember if we had one after Guild Reset yesterday anyway. So we will definitely need to make sure we have one before that sword disappears. To make sure that we do continue to get our credit. 420 is our power. See, one would definitely be as packable. Um, let's let's go let's go for it. Three one. The top team we're gonna take on three. Second team on one. Perfect. We're right where we want. Actually, hold on a second. In this be. Do I try to think if there's gonna be enough power if I pull Yasmin down to two for this one and put here I put Karf up. Uh, actually, yeah, I do think there is. Okay, let's do it. Just so I can have a little extra gun power. Sign elbows here. Perfect. Normally I don't. Well, no, not two. And then we will. For the moment, that'll be our new lineup. to say mistakes were made, but thankfully they did manage to pull it off. This is the fight we're expecting to lose. Look at the boys 
they're holding over that bungee wood. Right over 30 seconds. I didn't give them that long. Alrighty, the ball that decided it all. Hold on a second. Go back in here. Take a look at stuff. I can reset the defenses if I want. Okay. That team I'm fine with. The other two I'm going to want to reset. Him down, move him up. And team three can be that. Team two, the buffs. Actually, can she take some? I mean, I was. Okay. She can take Elvis, put Oliver up there to help what you call an aquatic fungi. Here we go. Okay, 260. Let's see if we can find ourselves a slot to get back inside the top 300. <coughs> Sorry. Still this deep. to win moves us to 283 inside of the top 300 just as the sword disappears. Now I don't know if it's going to credit us having that prior to the decisions for leveling but we can hope. We can also take a look now at the new task that should load in. And it hasn't. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, yeah, it did give us the 283 ranking. That is interesting. Because we should have the doll event 5. The only weird potential could be if what's causing boxy to delay 
but I think all of them that we hit the level is yes, also behind the task not appearing. But we will definitely dig into well, and I hope we have to have more knowledge as to what's going on. Or part two later this evening. In the meantime, let's go ahead and cradle to the stars here in Asgard. I really don't want to burn much energy, mind you, if it isn't going to count for the new task yet. So we have an 84,000 ranked 125 boss. So far, we're level 100 heroes trying to take it down. If we would have survived another explosion against the side. Oh, there's a chime. Let's go down to take a look at the mailbag. Okay, I guess the event's got to be active at least for somebody. Because we, you think we wouldn't have gotten Nebula dolls and the equipment chests if it wasn't and yeah it still isn't there at least on our list which makes me think that it probably will require a regular reset of the game in order to make that happen. However, of course, graphics and everything go pretty chaotic when that happens, so we'll save that for part two this evening. Let's get our last expedition of the three going, and then I have a feeling we can probably just bring this 
particular part one to a close. As always, make sure you do like, share, and subscribe. Get us to those goals of now 50,000 viewers, a few of the videos, 1,000 subscribers. So Boxy will send those nice red boxes our way to send to you. And YouTube, Google will start sending us gifts that we can also send as well. Now, okay, we've got to come a little better of a spiel for it than the previous. Of course, Coinbase and Ibotta are still available. $10 each when you do fill out and sign up for those services. Coinbase Learn, of course, two-minute lessons, one-question quizzes. Get yourself up to $100 of free crypto to use in Dominion or anywhere else you like. Anywhere in the world. And about, of course, rewards you for what you got to do anyway, make it grocery shopping or any other purchases. Might as well get money back through Ibotta. Then we do meet for part two in the evening and, of course, more shadow people to conclude tonight in the night in the desert overnight slot. Love one another, of course, again, because when it boils down in the end, that's all we have is one another. Like, share, and subscribe. May your fights in Dominion be awesome, and it's always a great new world to release the Krakens. Have a great afternoon. See you tonight and overnight for more from day one. Again, next show premieres at 2 a.m. UTC, 8, sorry, 9 p.m. Eastern. See you then.